Hello, this is Dr. Rhonda Johnson. Today is Saturday, February 4th, 2023. And today I'm introducing Orthus, otherwise known as Omicron subvariant CH1.1. Well, it's not new. Uh, it's been around in Southeast Asia since November, 2022. But this is my first time discussing this uh, variant. It's been detected in 60 countries, including New Zealand, Cambodia, China, Ireland, uh, and Papua New Guinea. It's been nicknamed Orthus after the two-headed guard dog in Greek mythology. Here in the United States, it's been detected in all 50 states and currently responsible for under 2% of infections in the United States, mostly in the Southeast and the Midwest at this time. Uh, so what do we know about Orthus? Well, it emerged in Southeast Asia in November 2022. It's currently responsible for about 25% of infections in parts of the UK and New Zealand. It carries the genetic mutation previously discovered in the Delta variant, which enhances the ability of this virus to bind to respiratory cells. So that's why virus watchers are watching this variant. Now, in the populations where it uh, has a larger prevalence, it does not seem to be causing any significant disease, uh, severe disease. That's a good thing. Now, there was a preprint publication that means it hasn't been peer reviewed by Ohio State University researchers. They called it the extraordinary evasion of neutralizing antibody response. And they found that this CH1.1 had more immune escape than its parent BA2.75 and the bivalent COVID vaccines do not work as effectively against it. So why should we care? Well, as the OSU, the Ohio State University researchers noted, as SARS-CoV-2 continues to mutate and evolve, it is critical for scientists to monitor how the biology of the virus changes and its impact on the efficacy of current vaccines and treatments, including the current bivalent messenger RNA vaccines. I want people to know that the CDC is monitoring this variant and how they compete in the real world, we will just have to watch. Right now, the dominant variants are XBB 1.15, XBB, and the BQs. So folks, just know that COVID's very much around. New variants, subvariants are gonna to continue to be a part of our life. So act like you know the virus is around and use your prevention tools if you don't wanna get infected. Now these newer variants are resistant to antibodies that you may already have from prior infection or prior vaccination, but it does appear that the vaccines are protecting people against uh, severe disease and death. Okay, stay warm folks if you are in a cold zone. I know I am. I hope you're warm and sheltered and be careful and take care.